What's up y'all, I'm back with another TCM related video. Today we're going to dive into the first minutes and some of the general gameplay as a family member. So when the match first begins, family members need to tend to objectives first to make sure survivors don't have a smooth sailing experience. For example, here you can see the hitchhiker charging up a battery to amplify the electric fence to prevent victims from escaping. So I kind of wonder if there's like multiple cars spread out across the map that the family can use to charge up the batteries or if it's just one car in a randomized location and if the car is revealed to the family or if they need to find it when the match begins. It's also been said by the devs multiple times that if a family member or tunnel survivors or a survivor at the beginning of a match, at least two of them will escape. This reminds me of Jason and Friday the 13th needing to trap the phone and the cars before engaging with counselors because if you didn't do these side objectives as Jason, the majority of the counselors would escape if they knew what they were doing. See, now if victims sneak past the gate, you actually have the ability to kick the electricity back on via a red gas power generator that you can see here in this picture. And once you kick this back on, the generator turns on and secures the property again. I personally think family members having to juggle objectives and chasing down victims will play a big part in balancing the dynamic of each match. Also, I can see how teamwork will play a major role in chasing and managing the survivor's ability to escape. Just like this official tweet says, Leatherface's ability to destroy obstacles like a door or a barricade will make the life harder for the victims and even flush them towards a fellow family member waiting in the darkness. And as you can see in this picture right here, you can see the hitchhiker waiting in the darkness, ready to jump out on any victims running by. And there's nothing stronger than the element of surprise. And this game is going to have organic jump scares galore, I'm telling you now. And being able to coordinate a successful ambush is going to have a huge sense of accomplishment. As a family member and as a victim, it's really going to make you think twice about what corners you take during a chase. I honestly love everything that I'm seeing from this game. It's easily sneaking its way to the top of my most anticipated games of 2023. And I hope you guys enjoyed the discussion in the video today. And I hope to catch you in the next one.